I have a lot of new products to try and have no makeup so let's get started I'm gonna start with MAC this is the stroke cream in pink light I'm gonna start prepping my face with this I already moisturized and all that good stuff oh my face looks really red for foundation I have MAC Pro Longwear and this is on the shade NC42 so what I do I just unlock it first <laughs> and put one pump here and one pump here and then I'm gonna take a brush and blend this out and after that I will go with a beauty blender don't forget the nose it's so hot in Florida I live on Orlando Florida and it's so hot I don't know what to do with my hair it's so long but because we are about to be in fall I hope this weather start cooling down because it's so hot I'm gonna put a little more I just feel like I can cover my forehead well enough okay so once I did my foundation with my brush. I like to go with a beauty blender so I don't have the strikes of the brush. Okay, so I have one layer of the foundation. I usually go for my under eye circles with this to color correct, but I'm gonna go just with the concealer to see how it works. So I have the shade NC30. I saw a couple of reviews before buying mine because just the color reference. I use a MAC Pro Longwear Concealer in W25 but I think a couple of people say that it goes kind of, it runs lighter so I went and got the NC30 so what I'm gonna do is, I'm just gonna go yeah, this is light thank god I went darker <laughs> I kind of like this, but I don't know, not much. So it doesn't give me a lot of products like the shirt shape. Tarte shape. Okay, so we're just gonna start there because we don't know. Let's see. Let me blend. It brightens it at all. I feel. It's okay. My toes gonna be more full coverage. Well, I didn't put them a lot either, but for the reviews, I thought it was gonna be like boom, you know, in your face. Mm, I don't think I'm gonna keep this. This is first impression. I haven't used it before. Let's see. And I never go with second layers of concealer. Well, the camera looks really crazy, but I promise it's not as bad. And let me know about the quality if you have seen previous videos of mine. I usually record with other devices, but today I don't have it. My boyfriend took it and I'm recording with my phone. So this is all blend, it's creamy, easy to blend, really light, but I don't feel like it's full coverage. Oh, wait a minute, it said 24 hours wear medium to full buildable coverage, natural matte finish. So, okay, I see, yeah, it's medium, definitely medium to full and it's buildable, yes it is. So. Yeah, you gotta breathe first. We didn't give you knowledge. Okay, so I'm gonna set my face. I'm setting with Too Faced Peach Perfect. And I like this powder a lot. Let me set the rest of my face, put some bronzer and eyebrows, and I'll be right back. 
Okay, so I have a little bit of bronzer. I think I have to put more. It's just because in this camera, I look so white pale, but in my mirror, it looks good. So let's see. I use my tiny pot. This is in Lay Low. And I'm gonna use. Da -da -da -da. Can you see? Can you see? Natasha Denona Mini Lila Palette. I hear a lot of great things about Natasha Nedona, but I'm not gonna spend 120 something dollars on an eyeshadow palette. I love makeup, like I buy a lot of makeup, I own a lot of makeup, but you know, your girl has a lemon. So when I saw this little cute tin, look how small this is. I mean, it's $25 for her, yeah, I guess. But for comparison, this is the soft glam palette. Like, look at this thing, how small it is. Like, look. I was like, what? It can be the logo of Anastasia. So, okay, I guess she, she is expensive. So, uh, I've been loving purples and mauvies and... I got the, the Anastasia Beverly Hills Norbina palette though, and that palette is beautiful. But I'm gonna be using today the Natasha Denona, and I'm gonna use some something light and cute because I wanna go out and it's daylight. I know that doesn't mean nothing, and sometimes I don't care, but like I feel like something nice and cute. So I'm using this Morphe brush, it doesn't have number or anything, it's just a Morphe. And I'm gonna be taking this color here. And she better not have fallout because there's a lot of great things about this makeup brand. And honey, this is blending. This is blending so easy. Boom, that's it. I'm done. Let's go. <laughs> Okay, stop. But not for real. Oh, I hate that world. Oh, I like it. But I'm still not gonna spend hundred and something dollars on her makeup palette, so I just can't. But wow. That was so easy. That's it. I have my crease. <laughs> I was gonna look like. I have a mirror. <laughs> so next, I'm gonna take a smaller blending brush, and this is more small, like tapered. It's Morphe. Oh, M433. Alright, we got a color, and I'm gonna take this color right here, and I'm gonna put it on my crease too. We we'll have some purple moment. Oh my god, this color is so beautiful. So purpley. Mm -hmm. I don't much with my shirt. Look at how cute. And then I'm gonna use Sigma E55 and I'm gonna take this gold kind of champagne color. And I'm gonna put on my leg. Ooh, nice. This is just straight from the eyeshadow. This is nice. Well, I see why she charged so much. This is beautiful. I gotta say, it's beautiful. Okay, so I kind of want to use this color, but I don't know where. Let's see. This is another Morphe. This is a smaller brush too. Let's see.
Lesjes gaan vinden. Oké, okay, dat is nice. Oeh, I like it, Lesh. Oh, like I like that. <laughs> Oh, this is nice. This is nice. I don't know what is up with that color, but that is nice. And I'm gonna go back with the metal color because I think it's gonna to, to blend better here. Okay, so we got that, and on my lower lash line, I'm gonna use this one because it's that's the only one we have left. So first, I'm gonna take this e.l.f. blending brush, this is the blending eye brush and I'm gonna take first this color to have some color first. I'm gonna use next this short shader brush E20 from Sigma. And I'm gonna use that purple color. Oh, look at that much. I'm gonna go back with my blending brush and blend everything out with whatever product I have left. I like this pop here because everything's so purple, like that blue, it's like I'm here. <laughs> so I'm gonna put some lashes on and I'll be right back. For blush, I'm gonna use MAC Take Me Home. <laughs> For blush, I'm gonna use MAC Take Me Home. It's because it's purpley and mauve, so it just goes right with our makeup. I like to bring it to my temples lately. Okay, so for highlight, we have the one and only Fenty Beauty by Rihanna, How Many Carrots. This highlight, I used it yesterday because I couldn't wait until the video, but it's beautiful. So I'm gonna show you the way, I'm gonna show you the way I like to use it. And I, because this is just straight glitter if you don't like glitter this is not your highlighter because this is just straight glitter so what i like to do is i'm gonna set my face for that i'm gonna be using the urban decay and i'm gonna i'm gonna use first this is anastasia and amaretti highlight and I'm gonna use it with the Anastasia 823. And I'm gonna put first. It's not that she needs any help, but that highlighter is so beautiful. I like to whatever is left. So I put on my forehead. Okay, so let's talk about Fenty. Let's take a minute. This is a diamond bomb. I know you guys seen it all over. It comes with how many, how many, 8 grams, 24 ounces, 28 ounces. Is that what they normally take? Well, no. This Anastasia and Amarisi highlight, it has 31 ounces. I mean, it's not that far, but just saying. And then this packaging. So beautiful even though if you don't like this highlight you just need it because of the package it's beautiful it says how many carrots 
And when you open it, look. Like it's so blinding and it looks wet. And the mirror, look you. Hey, how are you? <laughs> so, highlighting. Okay, so Anastasia doesn't need any help. This highlight is blinding, it's beautiful, but we extra. I said I wanted something simple, and here I am. Okay, so what I did, I just light well, Let's do it with a brush first. I'm gonna take this is Morphe again. <laughs> um, it's this brush, and I'm gonna swipe once, and I'm just gonna tap. And it just had, it just add, it looks kind of wet. I liked it more with my finger when I did yesterday. There you go. Now you see how that looks. I mean, I should have do it by yourself because Anastasia kind of has her own blindness. But we already did it. You see how it adds the wetness? Kind of, I don't know. Maybe I just do another one using it you by yourself. Oh, oh, you can see the glitter here. Oh, I didn't, I didn't realize that before. Well, you can see the glitter from the side. <laughs> but it's beautiful. So, I'm gonna, since we have in our shoulders out. I'm gonna put some here. Let's be going You see this one is nothing. You see how this one looks wet and nice. And like this I like it. I don't know why people say oh, well I know it's, it's people that doesn't like being extra but I, uh, I like it. I'm gonna do a nude pinky situation. So I'm gonna use Makeup Forever. And this is in the color AOA Boundless Berry. So, let me, let me do it like this. <laughs> no, just kidding. My first time using it. I have so many makeup that I bought, but I haven't used it or put it away just because I want to do a video. Then now that I'm sitting down finally doing the videos, I'm having the chance to try them. Okay, so we got that. And then I'm going to use MAC Velvet Teddy. I've been loving this lipstick. So this is the final look. First we wanted something simple and we have a full big face with extra glitter. A little bit more of a setting spray so that glitter doesn't go anywhere. Okay, so what I got to say of all the products that we use is this matte concealer, it's okay. It's, if you have heart shaped tape, if you have born this way foundation, I mean born this way concealer, you really don't need this. I don't know, it's just, it just, it was okay, it was okay. I don't know if I'm going to keep it or bring it back because I've been loving the Born This Way concealer so this is like why you know and then let's see what else we try new this mini, mini palette is beautiful I love this palette then what else is new this lip liner is beautiful it was easy to like line my lips this is a yes no yes yes <laughs> No, this is a beautiful highlight. Yes, you're not gonna. If you are someone who doesn't like 
glitter this is not for you but if you like to give it that extra pow like this is your friend this is gonna be for you I love it I'm keeping it I'm missing in a corner highlight excuse me how that can happen Okay, so this is the finished look. I hope you like it. If you do, please give me a thumbs up, subscribe for more, and I see you in my next one. Bye.